Glass bottles and used tires aren't really the first thing that come to mind for home construction, but that is exactly what one family in Greene County is using to build a home. Two years ago, we first introduced you to the Craigs building what they call an Earthship home. Storm Team 2 meteorologist Tara Hastings has the follow up to show us the progress. The Craigs are like any other family with two young boys, always on the go. But their home isn't made of brick and mortar. It has been a whirlwind of activity. Um, it feels kind of like a blur. Two years ago, there were tires lining a piece of land. Today, there's a floor and a roof. The first room on the right is going to be our, our bedroom. The idea behind their Earthship home is to use recycled materials and use natural resources. The project has been a learning experience, and volunteers have played a big part. I think one of the, our favorite parts about this whole process is like during the weekends mainly, you know, we'll be at the house working and we hear someone pull up the driveway and we just have people coming from all over the place just stopping in. For Zach Craig, it's been a labor of love. All of his spare time has been researching and working on the home. This will not have any exposure to the sun. So for us, we get the cave effect in here at 55 degrees, and then we can control it very easily to do long-term food storage. The temperature control of the home came from the biggest project, packing tires. This tire wall took a little more than a year to complete. There are nine layers, and each tire weighs about two to 300 pounds. Now, once finished, this is going to be sealed with adobe, which is a mixture of sand, straw, and clay. So as the sun comes in from our south facing windows and it heats that wall, it's going to slowly transfer back into the wall. And then as it cools off in the house, it's going to pull that back out. Piece by piece, this house is starting to look more like a home. The Craigs are hoping to be move in ready before the fall with great stories to share with their two boys. I'm meteorologist Tara Hastings, 2 News, working for you.